Bangarang Rufio, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Lost Boys Gaming. Today we have a new development in a story that we covered a few weeks ago, but we've got to get into as we have some new information that is critical and huge and could mean that we will be getting a huge announcement from Microsoft and from Nintendo in the coming weeks. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Today, we are talking some more GoldenEye 007. Now, Video Games Chronicle is reporting today that a GoldenEye 007 remaster could be revealed in the next few weeks. So let's just hop right into the article. Uh, HD remaster of N64 classic GoldenEye 007 could be revealed as soon as during the next few weeks it's been claimed. That's according to Venture Beat journalist Jeff Grubb who stated on his premium giant bomb show Grub Snacks that he believes that Microsoft is likely to announce their revival rather than original publisher Nintendo. This matches what one source has recently told VGC. Grub said, quote, I think that Microsoft is going to be the one to announce that first. He added, I think this game is probably coming pretty soon. I'm thinking in the next couple of weeks. GoldenEye 007 has infamously been somewhat of a legal nightmare to release in the past, with rights holders Nintendo, Microsoft, and MGM theoretically all required to approve the new version of the N64 Classic. However, 2022 marks the 60th anniversary of the James Bond franchise, leading many to speculate that the most iconic video game in the franchise's history could finally be re-released as part of the celebration. And there's some evidence that this could happen. In January, Rare developers were spotted unlocking Xbox, Xbox achievements for GoldenEye 007, implying that a previously canceled Xbox 360 remaster could officially be released for modern platforms. We also got to talk a little bit about what Nintendo did recently. As many of you remember, may remember, last year uh, they did some legal work uh, in Germany to get the game off of the banned list for Germany. Now this is important to remember as the Nintendo Switch eShop for Europe and for parts of Australia and New Zealand is actually based in Germany. So in order for this game to be listed for the entire region, has to be, it has to be unlocked for Germany. Now as we know that this game was indeed removed from the banned list, so that would allow this game to be on the Nintendo eShop and sold in these, these other regions. The question that we also have to ask ourselves is whether or not we would get a remastered version uh, on the Nintendo Switch as the Xbox is going to see, or if we're going to see it added to the Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pass as part of the N64 library there. Now, what makes sense to me is if they released both versions uh, on, on the Switch, we would just see the remastered version as part of the 60th anniversary celebration for GoldenEye, uh, for James Bond specifically, uh, and Similar to what we saw from um, Super Mario, we got Super Mario 3D All-Stars and we had an upscaled version of Super Mario 64. And then they also put the regular N64 version on the expansion pass. So I could see something like this happening. Uh, that's the real question though that we really don't know at this point is which version we would see on the Nintendo Switch. Now we've got to keep uh, our eyes open for an announcement here in the next couple of weeks, as Jeff Scrub is mentioning. So it's, it'd be interesting to see what Xbox does um, and then to see what happens shortly after with Nintendo. If if they follow suit and announce something that will come to uh, the Nintendo Switch via remastered or simply as put on as part of the expansion pass. So hopefully this this means that we are going to see goldeneye 007 finally re-released i mean we talked about this a few weeks ago on the channel as we mentioned uh, and hopefully it's something that we really wanted to see coming in 2022 so the real the real question now that all we really have to seem to wait for is to see when this actually is announced and if it does come from microsoft or if it does come from nintendo first and then at that point uh, whoever it does come from first we'll even know uh, whether or not this is game is coming to the Nintendo Switch via the remastered or simply the expansion pass. So it'll be interesting to see what happens there. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little update. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe bu button and like this video today so you're kept up to date with everything going on here at Last Boys Gaming. We'll be sure to let you guys know as soon as we hear anything if this game is indeed announced in the next couple of weeks and hopefully uh, that we get the remastered version on the Nintendo Switch as well. 
So thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it. Until next time, we'll catch you later.